fighting out of Atlanta, Georgia. Weighing in at 188 pounds, he is the WBA Junior Heavyweight Champion of the World and the challenger in this contest. Ladies and gentlemen, here is Evander Holyfield. Fighting out of Morristown, Tennessee, weighing 187 and one half pounds. Introducing the IBF Cruiserweight Champion of the World, Ricky Parkey. Scoring on the 10 point must. Scheduled for 15. And watch with Parkey. Parkey throws out Leroy Murphy. He's from the opening bell. And Holyfield getting the right would look to stay away. Holyfield. And then come out to fight from the opening bell. Only betting proposition you could get on set about a bet. $90 to win one more than four rounds, showing a lack of confidence in a break. Parkey just got hit on a break, making out Holyfield and then threw a, a right hand witch bag of tricks. He's got that that wow, and somehow it seems to hit. Plan set out by Georgie Benton for Holyfield. Strong right. Jab, jab, jab in order to take from Parkey. Make him block the jab. Right hand. Double up with the left. Punches up, says the referee, Davy Pearl. And Holyfield at distance. Holyfield willing to fight in close. The first round. Scoring with lefts and rights in this first round. Said that Parkey's awkward Holyfield. Parkey came out onto Holyfield. Able to and did hurt Parkey. Battling right back every time he gets hammered. No punches being put in there by both men. They're standing close. There's no effort to get away. Combination by Holyfield. Effectiveness of the punch. Parkey is a punching machine. Look at this. Right hand drop, Leroy Murphy. And by Evander Holyfield. Marky stating shots. And that is the end of round two. What does your scorecard show? Both look. Oh, good right hand. There's that right hand we talked about. Just watch. It just comes from left field. There it is. Attempted to throw over uh, Ricky Parkey Mason back in the summer of 84, and he went right at the fighter as yet. And Holyfield again shaking Parkey. The legs buckle, Parkey going down. Parkey indicating with the uh, motion of the right hand that he's going to take the cylinder, but they're jingling and have good control of his legs. And Holyfield just teeing off with combination. Pearl's going to have to make a quick decision. Some blows. Coming up on 30 seconds to go third round as Holyfield is looking to finish Parkey off. And that is not the knockdown. It was a slip. Holyfield comes right after Parkey, who has nothing. And that's it. It's all. Evander Holyfield has stopped Ricky Parkey. Got his hands full for all three rounds. Parkey not at all an easy opponent, but he's just the devastation of his punches. They were landing accurately, crisply, and his game plan just paid off for him. Ricky Parkey in a valiant performance, but he could not really stand up to a performer that was as hot as Holyfield was tonight.